Hey guys, we're gonna work from this pant sleeve grip today. If you're not familiar with this passing from this position, take a look back at our uh, combat base staple gun pass. That's kind of the basic um, like initial way to attack from this position. Okay, so and that'll explain kind of the the uh, dangers of how you can move, how you should move from this position. The most important thing to just remember is how I'm using my knee, right, to kind of cut angles, right, uh, and then controlling the same sleeve that he has control of, right. I'm going to do the same pass. We're going to start the same way, right, I take a step back, and I'm going to shelf it on top. Right here, Kyle's going to quickly frame. He might even get a cross collar grip, okay, push into me, right, he's pushing because I'm trying to come down. And then he's going to use this to hip out a little bit hips out, and then he's gonna pummel his leg inside, okay? Once he pummels his legs inside right here, now I'm gonna turn both of my knees out, okay? And then I'm gonna do a penetration step over his knee here, okay? And then I'm gonna keep coming. I'm gonna let go of his pant sleeve as I come down, keep this going, right? And I'm gonna come over his arm. Blocking, making sure that this foot, I can control this foot. I'm taking it out, using my forearm to block. Taking a quick step back to shelf his leg. Kyle hips out, and he pummels his leg in here. As soon as he pummels his leg in, right, I'm lifting my hips up, turning my knees out, and I'm doing this penetration step over here. As my knee goes down, I let go of his pants. Okay, and I just keep spinning over. It's really important that you change the angle of your knee. <clears throat> right here. Lift my hips up. Turn my knee out. Right here. This is where I need to change 